Mr. Allen. And a Wiltshire regiment has been invited to spend the next three months in London guarding the Queen. 21st Signal Regiment based at Killern have been training for eight weeks to take over. They'll be seen by thousands carrying out one of Britain's best known traditions, the changing of the guard. No, no! Um. This might not be Buckingham Palace, but the ceremony is exactly the same. The changing of the guard is now largely just symbolic, but these are all serving soldiers, as many have been on the front line. But for the next three months, their bottom line will be protecting the Queen and the Royal Family. Well, I mean, it's fantastic. It's, uh, we've got a, a great opportunity here to show up the Royal Signals up, up in town in London. Um, in front of Buckingham Palace and James Palace, the Tower of London and so on. Um, we've brought together soldiers from nine regiments to do this, so from across the country and indeed in Germany. And uh, the privilege is great, and uh, the, the guys are loving it, they really are. The duty is normally carried out by the Queen's Guards in their distinctive scarlet uniforms and their bare skin hats. But when they're away on operational duties, other regiments are invited. It's the first time for the 21st Signal Regiment to face in Cologne. It'll be a complete change of scene for these soldiers, many of whom have seen action in Iraq and Afghanistan. But how are they going to cope with standing completely still for hours while the public try to make them laugh? Or in hot weather in those thick wool uniforms? I'm sure, as a lot of us have been to hot climates, doing more arduous things, the wearing a wool suit for two hours, I think we manage. You don't really have to stand still for a prolonged period of time because you can come to attention, change arms. You can always keep the blood moving around your body, so it's capable. Uh, quite a lot of pressure, <laughs> but um, quite an honour as well. Yesterday, the soldiers were literally put through their paces in front of family at the barracks. Maybe it'll all inspire some of the audience to want to be like Daddy. But for the soldiers themselves, it's a chance to make their queen proud. Sally Chaloner, BBC Points West, Cologne. Wonderful. Now, if you live in Bristol, do you know that you are now part of...